Prince Harry and Meghan Markle mocked for the funny moment which made us laugh a bit. One royal commentator pointed out a particularly awkward moment on Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's recent trip to Nigeria that stood out. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle had to sit through one particularly awkward moment during their recent trip to Nigeria, and royal commentators were quick to poke fun at the embarrassment. During their visit, part of wider celebrations of the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games, the couple had to sit in on a ceremony in which the national anthem was played. The Mail on Sunday's senior editor Charlotte Griffiths called the whole thing a farce, but appreciated the good laugh the moment gave her. Griffiths noticed how the Duke and Duchess of Sussex sat awkwardly while the music played, staring straight ahead instead of poker-faced. She told GB News, it's just a farce. But at least it made us laugh because the clip of them staring straight ahead during the national anthem is just hilarious. The couple's tour of Nigeria included visiting the country's military headquarters, meeting with charitable organizations and politicians, and promoting the Invictus Games. They also visited a school for a mental health event, and met wounded Nigerian soldiers after an invitation from the country's highest military official, Christopher Musa. Their fans were quick to compare the visit to a royal tour, but Griffiths bristled at the idea, criticizing the pair for simply representing the royal family. She said, they dress up how to be royal and it was also a fashion show, as far as I know. There was one event where Meghan changed her clothes in the middle of the event. She just ran to a side door to change her clothes. She's wearing an outfit that costs about £3,000, in Nigeria, where there is a lot of poverty. But I take these things with a great deal of salt. I must be cynical in my old age. Locals praised Meghan for taking part in talks and taking selfies during the visit, as well as co-hosting the women's leadership event. With Ngoni Okonyo Iwila, Director General of the World Trade Organization. She discussed revealing her Nigerian roots and delving into her identity, while Prince Harry visited a military hospital to meet wounded soldiers.